Let's take a peek, shall we, Lord Beerus? Okay, let's do this thing! Piccolo, what do you say? Want to train with me and Gohan? I've been raring to fight you again. Sure. Sounds good to me. Krillin, what about the rest of you guys? Thanks, but I'm gonna head to Master Roshi's and train with him, actually. Oh, well, okay. Up there, in the sky! He was attacked from above! There are too many innocent people here. Let's take this somewhere else. You agree to that at least? Too many innocent people? Well, that is a problem which can be easily corrected. Stop it! You bastards! It was my understanding you wanted the streets free of onlookers. Evidently, our solution does not please you. That's it! Follow me and we're gonna settle this! If all you know about me is from before I went to Namek, you're about to be in for a real shock!
Whoa! Hmm. You guys stay out of this. If I'm the one these guys want, then that's what they're gonna get. A most intriguing discrepancy, this dormant power. It departs rather considerably from the data previously compiled. But it is not remotely discouraging. His strength is within manageable parameters. Android number 19 shall now operate as your executioner. Is that right? Fine. Then get over here and fight me! Transformation put Goku on a level far beyond us all. <laughs> we'll see. You
If I want any chance of winning battles to come, then I need to train hard enough to find a level beyond Super Saiyan. It started. Piccolo's getting ready to fight. Yeah, but who? Do you think it's so? No. Whoever it is, I can't sense their energy, so it's gotta be one of the other androids. Stop, Gohan! We can't help it! We're nowhere near their level right now! All we do is slow Piccolo down! <sighs> Dad, that energy! It, it's gotta be Cell! He's on the move! use my instant transmission, I might be able to get Piccolo out of there! Thanks, Dad! Please save him! Calm, Gohan. Try to sense his energy signal. You're right, I can still feel it. Mr. Piccolo is alive! I'll buy us some time. While I do, you rescue Piccolo and hurry back here. But be careful! Uh, okay! You're Goku, aren't you? That's funny. How did you get here all of a sudden? I hadn't felt the faintest trace of your energy. That's for me to know. And you to find out. Hilarious. Well, finding out isn't exactly high on my to-do list. It hardly matters anyway, since you'll soon be more bio-extract for me to drink up. Go ahead and try me then, Cell. Out of my way, Goku. This freak is mine to deal with, not yours. I'm here, Goku. Let me back you up. Thank you, Tien. Goku, killing you will have to wait. I cannot allow number 17 to be absorbed. 16? You're actually gonna fight too? By my calculations, Cell and I are approximately equal in power. What? No! 
Ow. It's my purpose to achieve perfection! Listen, your bodies are way too injured to be fighting right now. I'm not going anywhere, so why don't you rest up and we can do this another time? The hell are you talking about? These little scrapes are nothing. We could still take you easy. Yeah, don't throw me any sympathy. I haven't had a scratch. What's that supposed to mean? Well, not naming numbers. But one of us was hogging all the action, and ended up with a couple boo-boos. So step aside and let a lady stretch her legs. <clears throat> yeah, whatever. You got any problems with that, Sixteen? Negative. Good. Glad we're on the same page. Tianchen Han, would you let me take this one on my own? Of course. Just be careful, Goku. Hey, I don't give a crap. Go ahead. You can both attack at the same time. It's no skin off my back. No way! You being as strong as you are is actually why I want to fight you one-on-one! -on -one. I want to test out if my current skill level matches up with yours. That's all. <laughs> don't start getting ahead of yourself. This should do it. How's that? Quit running! Get ready to see my real strength! You I wasn't expecting this today. Ugh, that's enough. Now my clothes are all dirty.
Wait, you're done? That was so quick! Untouchable as I am, I don't get that much of a kick out of fighting. Had enough time to lick your wounds? <laughs> you know androids don't run out of energy like that. I swear, you're the naggiest sibling in the world. They're putting up a much better fight now. Must have really got their head back in the game. Maybe from watching me against 18. Gotta say, Goku, you're as impressive a martial artist as the doctor said. That, and you're not nearly as annoying as that hothead, Vegeta. You kept your cool throughout that whole fight with 18, too. Making an android with unlimited energy sweat is quite an accomplishment. I've never had more fun. Only let my guard down for a second, but you're something else. I'm a little burnt out on all the fighting today. Let's get out of here. What's the deal? We going or what? <laughs> what? 16. What got into you all of a sudden? You look pissed. My mission is to kill Goku, and I intend to accomplish it. Dude, chill. I will end your existence, for it is the only purpose of my existence. Everyone and everything else is secondary. <clears throat> Then it's now or never. I can. Whoa. I'm not done yet. 
It all comes down to this. <laughs> Don't you dare, Sixteen. I'm not letting you blow yourself up. <sighs> Don't tell me. You have a self-destruct device inside of you as well? I... I told you both before. My sole mission is to kill Goku, at any cost. Then why haven't you already? You could wipe this entire island off the map with that explosion. Hmm. That's enough! You can't beat me in the state you're in now. Hmm. And besides, you don't really seem like a bad guy. Even if you're technically a robot, I could feel your intent to kill. But if it really is your mission, why didn't you go for it during the fight with Cell? Instead, you chose to defend your fellow androids, which means... It's simple. There is much wildlife living all around this island. I did not want to obstruct nature with the fallout of our battles. But hear me, Goku. One day, I will fulfill my purpose. You took care not to harm any innocent life, animal nor human. I believe you are both good people. I have enjoyed traveling together. Well, who says we can't still keep doing it? Then you know what? 
Let's have our first stop by the mall. I'm in desperate need of some new, less filthy clothes. <laughs> it looks like the battle is over. Yep. Goku! Where's Cell? And the androids! And, uh, uh, 18! You, uh, you didn't defeat them all already, did you? Well, I think they'll be back. Huh? <laughs> In the wake of Cell's defeat, the three androids depart. Peace is once again restored, thanks to Goku and his friends. Someday, these powerful artificial humans may show their faces again. But when they do, will they be friend or foe? Whatever the outcome, Goku is sure to be stronger than ever and ready to defend...